Hi everyone, it's Ryan with SacramentoAppraisalBlog.com and today I wanted to show you how do you calculate the months of housing supply in a real estate market. Okay, we're always talking about housing supply or also known as housing inventory and today I want to show you this simple metric I think because it shows I think a temperature for the real estate market. How is the real estate market doing? How many sales have there been recently compared to how many listings there are? Okay, if there's an exponential amount of listings, it could mean, I think, bad things for property value sometimes, but there's definitely implications for marketing too. This is super easy. Let me show you how to, it's done in Sacramento MLS. You can use any MLS system, or even if you don't have MLS, as long as you have access to two figures, recent sales and current listings, you'll be good. So in Sacramento MLS, I went to search and I go to standard. I've selected all single family detached homes. I have all categories of listings selected. These properties are currently on the market, whether they're short sales or arm's length uh, listings, it doesn't matter. And I'm looking at the last month of sales. Okay, today is November 6, 2013, so I want to look at all sales from October 6, 2013 through today. Okay, in my MLS, I click statistics because that's going to get me these two metrics very quickly. And really, it's a matter of looking at the most recent sales. There were 1,183 sales in Sacramento County over the last month. Currently, there are 2,895 listings. How do you ca calculate the housing supply? It's so easy. All you need to do is divide listings by the last month of sales, and that'll get you the monthly housing supply. So when I take 2,895 listings divided by 1,183 sales over the last month, I get 2.44 months of housing supply. What does that tell me? That tells me that it's going to take uh, 2.44 months really for all these listings to be absorbed in the market. Okay, And so that's an important metric, and I hope this was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions. Take care.